right, this is a song I wrote, and it's uh, YouTube, several versions of it. And, uh, this is one where the song title came to me in the night as I was dozing off, and then over the next few months I proceeded to write what felt right. Well, it's good to see you. Yes, it's been a long while. pretty in pink and you still have that beautiful smile but I'm wearing black till my blues come back in style is the color to wear it shows proper respect for love that's been buried somewhere I once thought that you loved me but I guess I missed that one by a mile So now I'm wearing black Till my blues come back in style I remember the last time I saw you you wore a white gown as you walked down the aisle. And when you said I do, you looked back over your shoulder at me and you gave me a smile. Now that's a memory that's been burned into my mind gonna be there for quite a while. So I'll just wear black till my blues come back in style. blues come back in style boy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> my voice gets deeper like every every five minutes or so that's it. <laughs> I used to be a soprano <laughs> no, really, yeah. <laughs> in school I could get C above high C before everything started going to the He wasn't kidding. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, was, I was like six foot tall and sound like Slim Whitman or something. <laughs> I, I used to sing bass for Slim Whitman. That's how high my voice was. Right? <laughs> no, no, I, no, you made that up. Okay. Let's hear some high pitch stuff. <laughs> this, this next song I did not write, but I published. Uh, I used to be very active in publishing, and I got very few songs that I actually published, but this is one written by a fellow named William Farley in Memphis, Tennessee, and he one of the best songwriters I've ever known. He writes like Chuck Berry or Leland Stover or Hank uh, Wayne or somebody, but uh, let's see if I can get through this. If I remember the words, we'll do fine. Don't keep it 